All right, Barry. Let's have a word with you. Barry? Am I remembering that right? Who is it? V, your neighbor from upstairs. Remember me? Talked about Prem rides. Back then, you were pumped about the Mizutani Shion. I said it was for flash posers. You don't forget a cop thing like that. Give me this look. I was about to hightail it to the Badlands right then and there. Oh, hello. I don't remember. What do you want? Um. That's body. People like us uh, have to get used to loss. All right. Just wanted to see what's shaking. Friends say you never leave your unit. Think I've got an inkling as to why. Seen that look before. It's all too common among people like us. Us? <laughs> you don't look like a cop. Badges don't get a monopoly on laws. You see death every day in my line of work. You get I said I thought I could sympathize with him. Until it hits someone you're close to. You too. Come in. You want to talk about it? I lost someone close to me, too. Damn good friend. What do you mean, well. two? Wait. It's about Andrew. He, uh... Told you about him. Best bud I ever had. Known in my whole life. Only person I could spill to without being judged. NCPD hasn't improved, has it? Guessing things at the NCPD haven't changed a lick, huh? One time, a Maelstrom ganger killed a young kid right in front of my eyes. For shits and giggles. I couldn't do shit. The son of a bitch had corporal protection. Ah, <sighs> typical. Our chief greases his palms with an anonymous donation. And guess what? Officially, kid blew his own brains out. Right in front of your eyes. Something died in me then. I couldn't do it anymore. I was... A few months later, Andrew passed, and everything went to shit. What about your friends on the force? Presumably the guys that were out there a couple days back. You didn't have anyone to unload on at work? How about Petrova and Mendez? Petrova's a decent gal, but she's not good with this stuff. Mendez just doesn't get it. He thinks us blues need to be tough. Can't bear the sight of a kid getting murdered. Born with pussy genes. According to him. But you told him about Andrew. Honestly, thought about it a lot. Anyway, they don't know everything. Better that way. Ooh. Do I want to ask him? Seems a little insensitive, but... Can you tell me how Andrew died? Does it matter? Normally. From old age. It's no wonder, seeing as he was only a few years younger than my grandma. Dying of old age? In Night City? That merits a monument. Whole world should gaze up at it in awe. <laughs> Ashbox and the niche will have to do. Andrew was like a grandfather to you? So then Andrew was more like a grandpa to you than a friend? <laughs> we can go that far. He was like a... I don't know. A window into the past or something. He reminded me of my gram-grams. About our little talks. Time when everything had its proper place. You know? He was the last... living record... of those times. Everyone's got their limits. Mendez doesn't know shit about life. Everyone's got their limits, even him. He just hasn't reached him. Not like you. What if he's right, though? Maybe my genes are soft. Your genes aren't soft. Don't only the strongest survive. If you felt nothing, that means his loss wouldn't have had any meaning. I guess so. Thanks for the talk, V. I am. Um, I need time to take all this in. Sure thing. Take care.
Yeah, I mean, it, it is true that only the strongest survives, but what defines the strongest doesn't mean being callous. Those aren't the same thing. Where are you guys? Oh no, you're probably in the precinct. Find Andrew's niche before talking to the cops. Niche. Optional. And my current objective. Ten thirty. Do I want to run out and do that? You know what? Let's do it. Let's get a little sidetracked. Who's it gonna hurt? Might have a pop into the Second Amendment here. Just to see if he's got any new merchandise since I've last been in. Happy new gun owner, I hope. You say that every time I walk up to you. Eh, not really helpful. Can I... Let's have a look at this one. And just in terms of mods, down, down of a legacy, pulsar, down of a legacy. Uh, I don't think I have any. Mind you, if I take the, if I go to, nope, backpack, check my this one. I just wanted to look at the mods, buddy. Okay. If I unequip that, replace that with that, and then stick that on there, there we go. That's what I want to do. I want my pistol to be my main slot. Right, let's do this. Find his niche. Deregulation. Increased deregulation. Just what this city needed. Guided by the standards they themselves have established. Thank you for joining all of us here at N54 News. We'll see you next time. I may be a capitalist, but I'm more of a Keynesian than a, um, than a, uh, classical free market capitalist. Let's get that. No, I'm using the bike. Oh, you're, okay, you're not coming towards me because you're too close. Uh, do I intervene? Hold on. That looks like... It doesn't seem to be a thing. Maybe I could... Uh... Tiger Claws. This is a bad idea. Let's do it. Okay, come out of it. Come on! Damn it, what happened? Reloading! Never mind. Uh, I'll take that incendiary grain, some shotgun ammo. Oh yeah, I'll take that as well. I'm just gonna quickly clean up here. And I don't want to take food off of people's corpse. Another Lexington I can sell for 95. Sure. Uh, yep. Yep. And yep. Yeah. You put them on, okay? He don't want him? He's my son! 
Why you being like that? I ain't yelling. Some valuables, some jewelry I can either sell or get into components. Recon grenade. Don't know what that does. I really kind of dealt with all this, but you know, I'm glad I. You know, had I killed some tiger claws. I don't suppose you mind if I just nick. Alright. You're welcome, the NCPD. I've now helped you kill some Tiger Claw Racketeers that you were fighting. Don't know if that was actually a thing, but it's, uh... They didn't seem to mind, so... Tarot card down there, I'll come back. I'm gonna be near that area fairly often, so I see something like that. I might not necessarily stop to go grab everyone just because I'm near it. I mean, I've got the whole game to search for tarot cards, I think. Check in before I. It turns out I have got, like, you know, after this mission, Misty's gonna get friggin' hanged or something. Colum columbarium. I don't know what that is. NCPD's here. Is it a hostile area? Are they going to have a problem with me walking in here? Or is it a... Oh, this is a... Um, this is a... Uh, memorial? Almost uh, looks like a necropolis. But I think it's more like a... Let's just qu quickly run over while I'm here, there was a tarot card around. Filter. Tarot. Wasn't there a tarot card right here? I saw one. Hang on. Wait, 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 wait. There it is. Why, why does it go away? Point me to there. Point me there. There it is. There you are. Uh, temperance. Hello, Johnny. Loving memory for best friend Ernest. You were a tortoise, but you listened like a person. You were there when my Grammy explained what was right. Uh, you were the last memory of a better world. A tortoise, he lived a long time. Tortoises live long. A tortoise? Is this some kind of joke? I don't know about you, but Barry didn't seem like the kind of pig to crack jokes. What, a tortoise? Makes no sense, Johnny. Barry said he was the only person he could spill his guts to. That not a good enough reason to buy a niche in a wall? Pay a visit from time to time? What's wrong? What's not normal about it? He called him a tortoise. I can sort of... a tortoise. Maybe overpronouncing it there. He called him a tortoise, but... So, you ready? There's nothing wrong with... It's a bit of a weird thing to say, but it's not... Abnormal, surely. Ah, oh, you're right. You do, kinda. You sound like an asshole. Guy was depressed as shit. Only friends he had wouldn't listen. What the fuck else was he supposed to do? Picture this. You've got no one. Beloved granny's been in the ground for years. Oh! Only thing she's left behind is a dumb fucking tortoise. I am an idiot. I am a complete idiot. Life, that tortoise was there. When that same life kicked you in the net. Oh, fuck. I, sorry, I am so sorry. I am just an idiot. I didn't catch that. I thought he was calling, like, an old... Because he was an old person. You live a long time. That's a tortoise. No, literally, it was an when actual Gramps tortoise. Croaked, it was right there. Imagine how alone you've got to be to buy a niche for a goddamn animal. In fairness, you know... He's not okay, definitely. Clearly it's- it, I mean, this is a lot to do for an animal, but people love their pets, you know. Barry's not okay. I mean, if that tortoise was the one thing that got him up in the morning. Now you're starting to get it. His friends have to know. Hopefully it's not too late. You know how it goes. Stare too long into the abyss, the abyss will stare right back at you. Taking Thanks, a step Nietzsche. into it wouldn't be so drastic. 
considering the shit he's seen in his lifetime. I can't believe I didn't immediately catch the fact that that was talking about an actual tortoise. Lucius Rhine. The former mayor. I'm such an idiot. Oh, oh yeah, no, it's like he calls a man a tortoise. It was an actual tortoise. Like, I thought it was like, you were like a tortoise. I thought it was an illusion. You were as a tortoise to me. Like, I've had pets die. I had a... Um, a cat I've had since childhood, about a year ago, passed away. You know, that really genuinely sucks. You know, sometimes your pets can mean an awful lot to you. But if the tortoise was the only thing getting up, up in the morning, he needs better, he needs friends, he needs, those cops need to probably take better care of him emotionally as opposed to, he needs human contact. You know. I, like, as much as I loved my loved my cat, and I did, um, I didn't then go out and hire the mass pipes and drums to play Amazing Grace at his funeral. I mean, maybe we could help him out, but with all the will in the world, V is not the most emotionally open person, and probably not exactly what Barry needs. He needs his friends. She doesn't seem like kind of the greatest people person. Unless you're, like, particularly compatible with them. And I don't think Barry and V would get along that well, apart from, you know, is a chit-chat on the side of the... on the way out of the apartment. Hey, your boy over there needs some human contact pretty badly. Maybe you could... Talk to Barry. He finally decided to get his shit together. For crying out loud, Mendez. What did Barry tell you about his dead friend? Hey, so what exactly did Barry tell you about that friend he lost? Not much. Hardly ever spoke about him. Said once he was the only one who could understand him. It's nice to have someone like that. He's very, very depressed. We had a little chat. He seems chilled, but seriously down in the dumps. Think he's got a bone to pick with Mendez. What? So why doesn't he say so to my face? I, I, maybe I just went past the whole tortoise thing about them. I don't know. Um, well, surely we, we got Come time on, to circle back to it. Short. Clearly, he couldn't stand his job and didn't have anyone to talk to about it. You said you didn't even try to understand him. See? Was I right? Uh, give me a break. Barry likes playing the drama queen. You just gotta shake some sense into him, trust me. We'll see. We'll have to check in on him later. Can I tell him about the tortoise? Oh, I... This is for your trouble. Okay, well, thanks. I should... I meant to mention the tortoise, but I thought there would be another way to do that. I didn't know I didn't... Had to mention Andrew's grave. Um... You should... He's got a... Andrew was a tortoise. There. I, I tried. I hope I didn't goof that one up because of that. It's another oh. bloody tiger claw. Oh. Well, these guys are all over the place. Alright. It's nearly midnight. Let's hit the sack. Ah. <sighs> 
<sighs> I still gotta check in on Barry. I didn't go back and do that. I, th I didn't even notice that. Let's have a quick shower. I don't want to smell like two-day-old clothes. <coughs> oh, she's coughing in the shower now. I've got to replace my, um... The tattoo, the Tiger Claws tattoo I got had on my hand with the, um... Ballistics Co processor again. I might go down to Vix and have that redone. Reattached, because... Double-checking I'm still dressed. Um, take that off. Hold on. See it? Yeah, no. And that, that gives her a freaking ponytail. I don't want that. Uh, no. Take that off. Put on a, say, a... Uh, No, that's just its own thing. It covers over the what's underneath it. Also, it looks awful. Um, that one can go and uh, over top. That looks like it would chafe. No, I can't find a better look, and it's kind of expensive. I'm just gonna go with what I had. Check I'm wearing that, yep. Alright. Let's go chat with Barry again. Let him sleep the night, think about it, and then I'll talk to him again. Nine, now. Nine, nine, nine. Trauma team. Barry! Again. Barry, you fucking asshole! I'm sorry, okay? Are you alright? Did he shoot you? Or did he kill himself? Mendez. It's too late. He can't hear you. Your genes were fine, Barry. You were the strongest son of a bitch I knew. Is that my fault? Did I say the wrong thing? I'm so sorry, Barry. I... I'm sorry. Can I talk to you guys? Is there any new... It's, it's a bit low frame rate over here. No. Is that my fault? Did I goof up? I meant to mention the tortoise. I really did. It didn't give me a second option. Alright. Let's go to the ghost town. Let's start, let's do another main mission. Let's head to the afterlife again. God, I've just woken up and I've already killed a person. This is not, this day is not turning out well. There's another ad for something. A lot of ads in this one. What is this for? Ah, uh, it's a, is it a, yeah, it's cologne. Alright, I'm just going to park back where I was earlier. Still not sure if it's a taxi stop. It looks like one, but there's no sign. And if there's no sign, they can't find you. Almost walked right past it. 
Back to the afterlife. It's taking pictures of me, that's that, yeah. Yeah, this is, um... Let me grab that tarot card while I'm here. This is giving me bad vibes. Just last time I was here, I lost a friend. How's things? How's things? Darlene. Thank you, he remembers me. I just want to say, I don't like the construction of this bar. It's all, like, solid surfaces and metal and glass and shit. The, the, the music would just be echoing all over the place. You wouldn't be able to hear anything. Hello. Did you change your mind about my offer? No, I haven't changed my mind. Good job. You know, rally Even rally. V can't remember her face. I'm Claire, remember? Um... Sorry, here for something else. Sorry. Stop by for some minutes. Oh. Gotcha. Sorry, I'm just uninterested in in, in, in in racing in this game. Just not not hey, this one. Lover boy. Just, uh, no. This trouble right the net around me? You won't. Okay. You know it. I lost everything. Let me be you. plain. Again. Solve your own problems. Clean up you your own what, shit. Go fuck yourself. Be careful who you bargain with. Well that was uh, I need a fixer. Oh, can we talk? Rogue? Wanted to talk. It's okay. Surprisingly... forthright of you? Hmm. Not here. Not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking Rogue, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess yeah. with her. She's got MRI. See right through you. Give her the truth. She should really be in some kind of supermax prison after what she did, but... The, case. the girl. Here we are. What was her grade? Why didn't you ask her? Might still be around, sniveling in a corner. Okay. Let's see what she has to say for herself, maybe. Hellman, need to track him down. Need your services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. I imagine. What Second is it? Second and third. Dexter Deshawn. Jackie Wells. t -Buck. Multiple bells ring in V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Uh, even you lost people in action or you got Johnny killed. Yeah, I'm gonna say that. You got Johnny killed. Wanna go through a little bit? She kinda really? didn't though, but... Fine. As much as I got Jackie Johnny killed. Silverhand. Zeroed inside our Sokka Tower. Before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just talk. Got nads on you, girl. Don't like that on every woman, but they seem to see you. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm hmm, see? Hmm, 15,000. That's almost all of the money I have. How much money do I have? 17,807, yeah. Yeah, that pretty much wipes me out. And if I don't have the cash? Uh huh. And if I don't have the scratch, it's fuck off and have a nice day. No, more like come back when you do. Them's the bricks. Mm -hmm. Then see ya. Soon. You know where to find me. You'll be here, presumably. Should I make more money or just pay her off now and make the money back? I suppose it doesn't really matter either way. I've got the 15,000. What jobs have I got? Um. See, I could go back to that. I'll pick this up eventually. All of this would just delay me. I can I can make the money back later. All right, let's pay you. Should be enough. Mm-hmm. Come back tomorrow. We'll talk. All right then. Tomorrow. And I'm wiped out. I've got to go do some jobs. Um, who was the person who just who you were talking to? Hey, interested in some work? 
What's this about? And who are you? Doing what? A business opportunity. Cargo transport. Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? Send the job to a fixer first. You ought to run this by a fixer first. Fuck the middleman. They're cash drained. Attitude like that won't get you far in this line of work. I don't need a consultant. I need a transporter. Will you do it or not? All right, I guess I'm listening. I'm listening. It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, then I tell you how to deliver it. Very straightforward. Mm -hmm. Everything except my pay. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. Imported and duty free. Duty free and detail free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? Would it give me this if I if I didn't have ah uh, whatever? Yeah, sure, I'm in. I can decide not to do Good. it later on. I knew we'd find acceptable terms. Head to the Kabuki waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words "No Future." Once you locate it, collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Mm, till then, I guess. If I don't want to do that for some reason, I could just not do it. Oh no, it wants me to wait. I got better things to do. That, like, what is it? Just early in the morning. Yeah, it's 8 a.m. I got other things I could do. Not a waste of day. No, I'm good. Actually, Chuma mine earned a spot on me. A chulo bowl with the bun? Yeah, sorry to hear. Remember his drink? The recipe? Vodka on the rocks, and lime juice, and ginger beer. Splash of love. That's right. In the drink's name. A Jackie Wells. Right. Well, the first Jackie Wells is on me. Thanks, Claire. No problem. Just holler if you need anything. Is that gonna be Definitely. like in the? Go for a drink. Hang on. Is that gonna be on the menu? Like any other. So what'll it be? Just checking. Stout synth. The David Martinez. See that seems to be the one. Hang on. The Johnny Silverhand. There we are, Jackie Wells. Four hundred and fifty dollars. Uh, you said it was on you though. One hundred and fifty per, for a drink that just gives you reduced. I I'm not sure I understand alcohol. Business booming, I hope. Seeing it yourself. Can't complain. Yeah, it does seem to be relatively booming in here. Thirsty, and we're here when they do. I still don't know why I this it's gonna be so wacky the atmosphere here is not great how's the afterlife working here I mean. no real complaints fights are rare and when they do happen they're over quick killer clientele you know, right? your words not mine all right thank you very much let's head out and we'll see what else they could be doing maybe I'll go speak to Meredith Although I should double check that she actually does want to have a job with me and doesn't just want... Because going to the no-tell motel is a bit sus. And I have... I've, I've absolutely no interest in just going around to sleep with the woman because there's nothing about her that's attractive to me. I have absolutely no reason to pursue that particular line. And I guess, like, some people don't necessarily need a reason, but I'm... My V is going to need a reason. Big in Japan. Okay. Well, I could... I'm gonna do another one of these, I think. Where's that on the map? A ways away, but apart from where I haven't been much before. Let's go do this. It seems safer than Meredith Stout's one. It seems more reliable. I'm more comfortable with it. A 
vehicle of mine went dark near your position. Okay. Fine. Keep an eye out. For unknown reasons, the coordinates came through corrupted, so I'm unable to determine the precise location. Now, oh, is it going to be on the map somewhere? There it is. About a block up ahead. Map is telling me it's here. At least, unable to determine a precise coordination. So it might just be the center of the search pattern, really. It, doesn't, it also doesn't show me how wide the search area is, so I've just got to look at the mini map and guess. Alright, I've been searching around for a while for this Delamain car and I cannot find it for the life of me. So, I'm, I think I'm going to cut the episode here uh, and continue on in the next one. I'll see if I can finish this one up, maybe I'll pick up when I find the damn Delamain and then I'll uh, <laughs> hit record and start going. I'm just wasting data on my hard drive now. So... That seems like a more bigger pain in the ass than the last one was. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut it here, and we'll continue on with the um, Hellman story in the next one.